What's good, Kaiju Wrecking Crew? It's your boy, Spider Minutes, and welcome to the Trailer Drops, our trailer reaction and review show for the channel. We got one special one for you today. Avatar, it just dropped yesterday. Finally managed to get ourselves some time to go ahead and take a look at it now. A bit of a disclaimer. What we tend to do over here on our little small side of the internet is whenever we do see these trailers, we want to watch them completely with fresh eyes. All of our reactions are genuine. All of our thoughts are genuine, just straight up off the cuff. But this one, we had to sort of tweak things a little bit. If you are aware, we did do our review of Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. If you haven't seen that, go ahead and check it out. And there they did give us a brief teaser of the Avatar teaser trailer uh, itself. So we kind of already seen it before, but we we'll still want to go down uh, and take a look at the teaser with y'all and give us, give you our thoughts. That makes sense, right? Yeah, that's perfect. So without further ado, Throw the ears on, let's get ready to go. Y'all ready for this? Let's go. I see that at first. <laughs> I thought it was just all the blue people jumping around. Little kid in the front. Got brother man all locked up and everything. Yo, this this does look beautiful, I'm not gonna lie. Jesus. I know one thing. Wherever we go, this family. Is our fortress. All right, it has been 13 long years since the previous Avatar, I guess we could say the first Avatar film now. 13 long years and there's gonna be some obvious changes. One of the biggest changes that I, that I have questions for is, I remember in the first film, humans could not stay out there in the wild without some sort of breathing apparatus. And now here we are in Avatar 2, in our little secondary story and you know straight up out here just breathing free now I'm, I'm wondering like is that kid the offspring of you know our previous duo of of navi or is he just like i don't know some some sort of refugee after the previous organization like dipped out after they got beat back by the by you know the native population. I, I don't. I'm I'm kind of curious when it comes down to that. Uh, is this is this a resurgence of of that former company because now you know they're still trying to get that unobtainium? There's a, there's a lot more questions than his answers. And as I said before in a few uh, trailer reviews, sometimes that is the best thing because the more times you're starting to ask some questions, you are. A little bit more intrigued by the answers that they give you instead of just leaving you so, sort of confused this isn't confusing this is actually me trying to figure out like where does a story go from here and it's got my attention which is something that that when it got announced it did not have uh, matter of fact i'm sitting here in the movie theater uh at the beginning of this trailer going like man who wants to watch this bull and then by the end, it's it's got my interest, and I'm like, okay, I I I can kind of vibe with this. Like, I'm not gonna say it's gonna be a good movie because like the last one wasn't like an exceptionally good movie. I I think I heard somebody on Twitter say that it was just a very expensive tech demo, and like, yeah, you you can kind of feel it because like the story wasn't you know I I incredible in any kind of way. But here we are, second Avatar film of I think four total that they've got on contract for, I, I believe. Uh, so we're gonna see a lot of these down the line. 
in a way, I kind of do hope this does well because I I did always kind of like the story uh, or at least the the world that they built uh, previously with, with the Navi. So I'm I'm curious, I'm intrigued, which is you know something that I wasn't uh, before Thursday when we went to see uh, Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. So so it's got my attention i'm down for it uh but anyway let us know what you thought about it down in the comments below uh because again we do like to hear from you guys our kaiju faithful also our question of the day what is your favorite mysterious like tv trope mcguffin that you've seen in a tv show movie read in a book that that the protagonist or the antagonist uh, we're searching for that kind of drove the story. I want to know what's like your best like little MacGuffin, your best version of unobtainium, unobtainium, unobtainium. Got it that time has been because again we do like to hear from you guys archive you faithful uh make sure that you are heading on over to patreon.com become a patron get your name added to the end credits of videos just like these with updates on the site the store and the channel and even get you some exclusive discount codes and use those discount codes on the link in the pinned comment down below in the description and also showing up on the screen right here we want to thank you guys for joining us hope you're having a wonderful day out there wonderful week it's getting hot it's getting hot we'll have to catch y'all later deuces